this bridge is different one wing from the other this is shorter but on shorter and thicker and thinner larger for the travel side and it's a guitar on its category best but it's not better than the new generation AG Barbero it's equivalent and I will prove it now to show you how the ebony fretboard kills the sustain that you can get with this. Look. Yeah. You see, that 
is very soon. So the Valvero is great for other things, not for sustain, as we prove in those Simplicio videos. But this guitar here, which is the, the equivalent of that in the version of maple fretboard and uh, Cremona maple bridge, same with Brazilian rosewood, and also double back. So it's also Valvero. This is this model here. First of all, it has the Whitner pegs, which make the difference. This is the difference. Because those are in direct contact to the wood. And let's test the sustain it just because of the ebony fretboard. Look how much sustain we lose. It died earlier. In fact, if you see the very presence of the third in the, in the internal structure of harmonics, and here we are talking about two guitars which have the top two in A for 40. So it's also saying this. But if you, if you see just now, uh, you can realize that this bridge is the bridge of flamenco because here the golpe and the percussive stuff it, it's, it's double powerful, listen because this is too hard uh, this is of course my opinion because I was asked about what's the difference and yes this is Better guitar than any other Negra in its category for sure, but not better than that one. Check the sustain one more time and check the presence of the third in the, in the harmonics. You have to listen to this note. Now with the new generation AG. More than double the sustain. That's what happens with the fretboard. Just the very fact that the that the maple fretboard is more resonant and lighter than that ebony fretboard, plus the bridge, which is direct contact with the with the, with, the, with the top, and the superiority of Whitner pegs directly in contact, allowing the vibration, because all vibrates together. In guitar, this one thing, and um, was it the description of this video I will post, the one that I post some a year ago or so, or so, with this all this research about which parts resonate with what. The top excites the back, the back excites the neck, neck excites it again back to the head. And back. So it's, it's a whole brown thing, and it's very interesting because. All guitar, not just the top, like, like Torres said, but everything counts, including, of course, the, 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 the tuning system here. Because if, if just if you touch this, just grab the guitar, put this in the play, you feel that this vibrates. So this means something. <laughs> right. But the most incredible thing is it. This just because it's the same model. Actually, these ball guitars are. Brazilian rosewood with the same top. The difference is the rosewood bridge, ebony fretboard, and maple fretboard and bridge. Now, okay. once again, let's listen just to the major third created here.
to post to this. This is not opinions, <laughs> this is proving facts, because this you can see. It's very, very evident. When I play a fifth here, this note comes really. Very present and last longer than when we play with this. At this point, it st starts to decay the, the vibration. But this is because of, well, you know, for me, this personal opinion, and some friends may share it, but um, tradition, if it doesn't bring you anything significant is obsolete. To me, it's totally obsolete. Meaning, this fretboard is too weighty. Like, now I cannot feel the same thing with the left hand. Already put me out of balance that. Then this, all these walls here, these two walls, make a big gap compared to this Titan thing in direct contact. And also, the uh, angle difference, which is much more uh, pronounced on the new generation model this year. Then another thing, well, this is also an ebony friend, but of course this is a universal guitar for 80 years from Marcelo Barbero. And this year has two fretboards actually, one of Brazilian Nasberry and the other of uh, uh, Ibert's Maple. So the neck will react also differently to different weight of the weight of the materials and to how it is to the end going because in this here we have should observe that we have the traditional way to strong it with the sixth string here, so fifth here and fourth here. Of course, with the machine head you can do either way. Observe the flawless though the design, which does, does not touch with the string any of the wood parts. And, and of course, this is a, a flawless guitar. As, as traditional guitar, this is so much uh, over that beautiful tone, etc. But also there, about the punch of the... Because the, the harmonic, an initial harmonic is just the top starting by one note or two in the, in the fifth sequence. This what you get here, that's it. It will not become more. But this here we have seen already, is of course made at the same time. I feel a lot of presence here, which I don't feel there. So I'm not married with, <laughs> with tradition, not at all. Nor did Paco was always objecting. Why do we have to have the same, like classic people? Because this is almost same like classic, actually. Like a high end, of course, but after all, ebony fretboard is obsolete and it reduces the, the harmonics. One last time, let's check that. In this here, you perceive very clearly that note. Right? And look how much it subtracts this beautiful sublime essence of the harmonics just the, because of the wood because ebony fragment means less say, means less playability means less not you know what I don't care and but I, tradition I actually I gave up center sample guitars altogether <laughs> but if this is extreme at least and because uh, Anthony is asking me uh, my opinion about this because I never compromise the truth, I don't need to. And always anyone who came for a referral or, or something with me, I always gave the, the, the truth what it is, as it is, naked. 
sometimes it may bother someone because of course if you are romanticizing the idea of the tradition you may think that the bridge dark bridge and dark rap will do anything to you it will not do anything actually you just reduce the, <laughs> the power of it right? this is because this, these two guitars are of the same price same category same thing so in fact, inside are the same too. But uh, the difference is that in one case, the fretboard and the bridge are in harmony, allowing the flow of these harmonics. While here are contracted. This is the process of this. what the fretboard and the bridge does to your guitar. Then now if we go to this, just the initial tone, meaning if this is great or not, or sucks or anything, that's what it is. So forget about, it does not become anything different to, to that. Now, this, of course, Paco said this is clear that the initial uh, strength that the guitar has, the drive it has already from, from one note, and Mainly he talked about the second string and the third string as symptoms of great quality in an instrument, which of course this guitar has, because AG has excellence in everything they do, even the economic models, what to speak of this. But this is a personal view, right? I, I, you know, you have to understand that I have owned and played every brand and every guitar you can imagine it exists in Spain and anywhere I have owned it and played. And I was never satisfied with this thing because I could never sound as flow as, 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 as I should. As I flow now, <laughs> it took me 30 years of waiting to find my own path on instrument, which is the Simplicio guitar, of course. And this happened only three years ago, three or four maximum. But you know, I have 40 years playing, so I have to wait uh, more <laughs> too much time. So be patient because you, 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 you have to find your own thing inside something which has also objectivity. Right? Because the, the moment we become analytical and unpassioned and just see what it is there, then you really, the door of, of knowing this and the box, actually knowing this, to, to experience the knowledge of this, it opens wide open this door for you. The moment you start with prejudice or with what everybody does, because everybody play maple fretboard, uh, ebony fretboard, that doesn't mean that this is better. <laughs> Many people drink Coca Cola, and that doesn't mean this Coca Cola is a good drink or healthy drink. <sighs> right? So, therefore, this uh, majority thing, this doesn't mean one thing for me. The tradition doesn't mean one thing for me. And if everybody does it, it doesn't mean one thing for me. If all the flamenco community does one thing, it doesn't mean one thing for me. Because I have my own path. So Paco taught me this, that a real teacher will teach you how to think for you and to listen for you and what, what is your sound and your flow. And this, this is definitive that the quality we have in this second string, for example, have guitars like this in the world, not only in Spain and in the world, a balanced guitar, namely that because of the double back and it's the way it is designed, you can have this in, in, in the posture that you play and, and don't need to hold it. You know what is to have free freedom in the this the the arms free. This no guitar can give you that. 
And of course, the, the, any Apple infrared port guitar, even if that is a, a, a double back one, it will not give you the same because it's too weighty on the head. To, towards the, the head, I mean, this thing here, which it may stay also, but this tends to become weighty on this pad. It's like the, this is the cough beauty. I would call it just, I don't know what I'm saying, but this is just to, to give a term. This beauty is, be is beautiful, but it's cold, like ice. And here I really listen to the warmth of the, the warm quality. The conclusion is that even the top model of the Ebony fretboard and Rosewood Bridge guitar, which is a commemoration of, of, of the Barbero 80 anniversary, it's a great guitar, and even Archangel would say so, which was the only disciple of Marcelo Barbero. Not Reyes, Reyes was never, and there is a video of Reyes himself saying it anyway. Because Mar Barbero has its importance. In fact, Paco said this is my favorite guitar back then because he had two or three original old ones and he liked always antiques they have a, a real thing, you know you need to see one, it has a certain charm but this here is perfect tuning everything, the fret is so much superior to any guitar as a category, but not superior to this because the new generation it just rocks the power it has as the sign and, and, and the, the proof that this changes uh, not only make it an ergonomic instrument but uh, it, it, it will be an instrument which delivers more and which actually transports you to another vibration but I said before that just by holding it by playing one, one note it becomes a, like a mystic experience, right? This is something which is unexplicable in words. But, but yeah. thanks to Wigner Pegs that created this, this mechanical Pegs direct in contact with this is so much. That also changes totally the equation when you compare to machine head. But anyway, this is the review and thank you very much. I'll see you next time.
improvisación es algo que yo pienso que cada músico debería, cada músico del estilo que sea, del clásico, del flamenco, de cualquier otra música debería, debería aprender porque en la improvisación te da mucha libertad y a la vez te da mucho conocimiento de, de dónde estás tocando y cómo estás tocando, de qué armonías están en cada momento. ¿no? Pablo, sí, Paco, ¿qué es para usted la música popular y qué es la música elitista? Yo creo que la música elitista es el refinamiento de la música popular. Por ejemplo, el flamenco. El flamenco originalmente es una música popular, la música del pueblo andalucía. Pero creo que ya no le pertenece más al pueblo, porque de pronto habemos gente que nos hemos pasado toda una vida encerrados puliendo esa expresión popular. Entonces ha llegado a un nivel en el que el, que el pueblo ya no, no, no tiene acceso, sobre todo a los matices que vamos consiguiendo la gente como yo, que nos pasamos muchas horas elaborando esa música.